Hey, what's going on? This is Matthew Continue. Welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy 1, Spark 6. I went to the Power Pants and I grinded off camera, so now everyone's doing pretty good so far. Got the good weapons, good armor, and such. Um, so yeah. Yeah, 18. Um, so yeah. This is the Crescent Lake. So, uh, yeah, I showed up the armor here. Buckle is good for the red mage and thief. <laughs> and I have a hundred hundred thousand gold, so I've got enough to get some good spells. And here is the uh, where you can basically buy uh, silver stuff. So I shall find a bear sword, and uh, once we go to the Volcano, so you don't really need to get the silver axe unless you really want the some better power. We already got the uh, silver hammer for the white mage. We already got the silver dagger for the black mage. So, and this is, like I said, it's supposed to be where you can first buy a silver sword. The town, the city of silver, basically. Yeah, there's some uh, stones, gray stones right here. I know some until now. I've not played this game like tons of times. So in the white magic shop, we have level six spells, and they're starting to get really expensive. Software, I got enough sauce for the game, because I grind off camera for a ton of gold, and I got them. I got about forty my inventory, so I don't need the sauce spell. Yo, know, I almost never use as many as you need for the soft spell for it to be worth it. The while, and it's more efficient to use soft, <clears throat> like when you buy them. Exit can't learn until you're white wizard. This completely takes you out of a dungeon using just one. Um, fog 2 increases everyone's targets everyone on a team. Increases their absorb by 8. Invest 2 targets everyone on a team. Increases their evasion by 40%. We're going to go ahead and get Invest 2. We'll get the Black Mage. Lightning 3 does more damage to the entire every team. The Red Mage would not be able to learn this. The Red Wizard would though. The R Red Mage and Red Wizard wouldn't be able to learn these three spells either. We'll get Rub. And we'll get Stun. Quake has chest gets to kill the entire enemy team, but it doesn't really work. It's Earth Element. So we'll get Stun. And I'll get Fog to for the White Mage. So yeah. Um, now we're going to save it. And now we're going to go to the volcano. Yeah, I've got a bunch of heels, a bunch of tents, a couple cabins, some houses, a bunch of socks, a bunch of piers. So let's go to the volcano. Hydras have about 200 HP and they hit pretty hard. Let's go ahead and take them out. I got one shot by EMP. Awesome. Just follow me and you, you won't get lost. Karibes have about 100 HP. They give like 240 experience and 20 gold each. So they're not really worth it at this point. Well, I'll, I'll fight them just for once. Use that lightning too. Yeah, they have about 100 HP. There you go. The Black Mage, I swear, seems to get get hit a lot more often than anyone else, so I don't understand it. We'll fight this ogre to go down one hit. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> the fire has 420 health. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Let me check my phone real quick before we go in. Okay. Let's go. Welcome to Gorogul Volcano. This is gonna hurt. Lava won't, but... 
Yeah, it's going inside. You're going to try and look up through the chest. The mug are not that bad. Alright, the wizard hawkers have like a hundred something health, the hyenas have about 120 health. Um The Wizard Hogger can cast Mute, Ruse, Dark, Slow, all that. Luckily we can run away from here. See some gold in there. Red wheels. They're not weak to ice, they're actually resistant to ice. They have I don't know how much HP, but they cast fire too and it hurts a lot. So but luckily we got away. If you couldn't run from that, that would suck. Alright, one earth. Luckily, we didn't get two. We use. Yeah, I got slowed. Yeah, I got slowed too. I, I got off camera some of the uh, spells so I could confuse them as well. And the white mage, I got pure, pure anti ice and such, so yeah. Luckily, fire does not uh, cast fire too, so it should be alright. 48 damage, that's not bad. But we got him down. A giant sword. It's not that great. 4176. Well, too much damage, but 5% more hit. I forgot about that. So you're going to want to keep that in mind if you want to get the four hits per turn early on. But I'm about to get a better weapon in here anyway. You can run from this. Yeah, this part six. I I wasn't sure if I said five or six, but pretty sure I said six. Red Hydra, he used Creamy, I think it's like similar to Fire 2. Uh, I don't know how much HP he's got, probably about 200. Let's go ahead and take him on. Try to put him down. Yeah, that's a lot of damage. We got him down pretty quickly. You can run from him, but I didn't feel like it. I didn't mean to use that, come on now. Right there, but whatever. So with helmet. This guy can also show up uh, randomly too, so yeah, we want to be careful about that. A hint of what's to come later on. Two, great. That's just awesome. Actually, we're gonna split the attacks up and use another ice too. Got it. plenty of ice too. Not kill the fire. Wow, he's dead now. Awesome. Gold. Okay. Okay. They have about 200 something HP. They have a lot of absorb though, so you want to be careful about it. Please, alright, go away. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Don't go this way. It just loops around. Uh oh, this is. Game over, basically. Oh, got away. Okay. We're, we're gonna burn through a lot of potions. I'm actually gonna reset after I uh, show off all the uh, treasure because we're running out of potions. Even though it looks like we got a lot. I mean, that fight actually cost us like a bunch of heals. Like we're down to 61 already. And there's nothing really worth it in these treasure chests. And we're almost 10 minutes in, hadn't even got to the boss yet. We're not even off this floor yet. One giant, shouldn't be too bad. Silver Goddess, Silver Helmet, Heal Potion, 
a cabin. It's gonna be a great one when you step in here. It has like 200 something HP, I think. But you can run from it. Silver axe is not really that good. But I guess for the hell of it, we'll. Weapon. Yeah, 4371. I mean, it's two more damage, so we might as well equip it right now while we can, you know? Got away. Actually, I'm not gonna reset it. I thought we were gonna, it was gonna be a lot worse than that. Alright, this guy cast Scorch, which is basically like fire to his entire team. This guy has about 200 HP, I think. There you go. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Not at all. 57, it's gonna be close. There will be no random encounters in the uh, fire, by the way, so. So just keep that in mind. As a soul character, it doesn't cost you as many potions, but the whole party, yeah, we're already halfway through our potions. Paralysis has squint, they can uh, kill you in one shot if you're not careful. But likely we got away. Yeah, this guy, wow, this all right, two more potions. And he, wow, Black Mage, seriously, stop it. You always got to stop. That's some of the Terror Hitler Down song. We're gonna tear him down. We're gonna bring him to the ground someday. Red Dragon, it's gonna suck if we don't run away. All right, we'll see him later on, but we don't wanna see him right now. It's a rare fight on this floor, yeah. Alright, so, so 4441. Damn dogs, it's 5 30 in the morning. He's barking again. Hey dog, wake up, he is recording. And weapon, go from 43 to 71. 47 A6. It's supposed to do extra damage to like fire enemies, but it doesn't work. And a flame armor will protect against ice. 50% less damage. I used to think it. Oh, red giants. They hit extremely hard. Let's get away. Wow. 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 No, don't heal you. Come on now. Just, I swear, like, it, it must be a bug or something, but the damn black mage, seems like when I carry black mage, it just hit, gets hit way hard, way too hard. Or it just gets hit more often than anyone else. Oh my god, it's way too much damage. It's terrible life. I'm gonna keep one anti fire on just in case. You got chest strike first. I think the ice sword will be in that chest chest that was empty, uh, but yeah. It's not there since we already picked it up. And there's a wooden thing here too. So Agma has about 250 HP. Yeah, he fought again! 
This is enraging. This is outrageous. 21 heals, it's gonna be tight. Like, got chest strike first. Alright, go in here. Padakama. We have a fight right here. Red dragon, run away. Okay, good. So we go from 48 and 41 to 58 and 54. A lot more evasion, a lot more health. I mean, uh, absorb. Wow. Four more potions right there. I'm gonna run to the fire on this floor. Uh, maybe not, maybe not. Don't die. Okay, so we made it to the boss. We're just barely enough potions. There we go. Is it you, the tender that defeated the fiend of the earth and disturbed my sleep? I carry will now show you the force of fire and shall burn its flames. Okay, so I'm gonna cast anti fire as if mute fails. It's gonna suck. Okay, so we got anti fire. Okay, so carry will only hit us one time, so that's good. We got lucky. Slow, she starts with six hits per turn and does like a ton of damage. If you're unlucky. But now she's down to one hit per turn, and it reduces her crit chance as well. Instead of having six chances to crit, you only have one chance to crit. So that's pretty lucky. I'm gonna try mute her anyway. And we're gonna dark her, see if that works. We're actually gonna try, I'm gonna try hold her. This is her weakness, but it's only got like a 10 or 15, 20% chance of working. So it's like a low chance, it's like a slight chance, basically. So we got her silenced. Set so fasting, I, I I'm gonna stun her actually. I'm gonna see if it works better. Paralyzed. There you go. I showed her for weakness. She is weak to being paralyzed. Alright. That worked pretty well, actually. Despite running low on heels. That's pretty good. Oh, it takes the scorpions on. For all time's sake. There we go. 315 damage. That's pretty good right there. Yeah, I think I... Yeah, I already saved, but I just wanted to make sure that way I don't die. And have to restart, redo the entire dungeon. That would suck. Be like, nope, don't count. Do it again. Sorry, try again. Man, I par man, man, that fight went overly well. I use anti fire so that her prior two doesn't hurt too much. I managed to uh, slow her down before she even attacked. I managed to mute her. I managed to hold her. I mean, stun her. That's pretty good. I, I mean, that went fairly well. I'd say that went a lot better than usual. Normally, it's it'd be. Uh, tough but it went pretty well I gotta say that, that was amazing that was one amazing fight I find I'll fight them so I'll fight in three see how much damage it does 352 wow 352 did way more 240 because they're weak to it. Alright, I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna step in here and I'm gonna buy the potion, so I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. So, got 99 heals, got some tents and such. Level 18. I am not sure if I'm ready for the ice cave. This is gonna suck if I, uh,. Yeah, it's going to suck. I'm going to give the Ice Cave a couple of tries, though. Let's go for it. 
go all the way to the ice cave. Actually, let's get some levels up if we can. We're level 19, because why not? That was not very effective, but we managed to destroy them before they got turned. That's good. We're not even close to level up, so we're gonna go save it again. Alright, so I've tied my bet my previous best for Deathless, so I met I managed to get to the ice cave. That's pretty close in the uh Yeah. I've had uh, several members die, but not a party wipe, so that's really good. So let's go for it. Go down this way, go up this way. There's only one way to get to the ice cave. So yeah. There you go. We save my heal potions. I'm not. Yeah, I'm just gonna reset out that. Yeah, the hydras have a high chance of going first. Like that's ridiculous. <laughs> um, that time they get chest strike first, but there you go. Okay. Now, if I get through this without too much problem, I'm gonna really be surprised. Alright, here's the ice cave. Probably the tu the second toughest dungeon in this game. The toughest is the Temple of the Past, in my opinion. So, yeah. And you're gonna see why right now. I'm gonna give it a chance, but I'm gonna put my Tampa Bay hat on backwards to see if that gives me a luck. And if we can get through this without party wipe, I'm going to be extremely surprised. But let's go for it. I've done it with a sub character before, but not with a party before. So let's go for it. Okay, so this can put sleep and stone us, which is fine. Cause I got enough soft. Okay, you can't run from this. But we've uh, got Lightning 3. I must save them for later, though, so let's go for it. Okay, we got one down. We got two down. We got three down. Okay, we're gonna get this one down pretty quickly. Alright, terminate. Nice. It's always a glorious day when a Black Mage destroys a wizard. That's really nice. With his physical hit, anyway. Okay, images, not too bad. Okay. Two battles down, many more to go. Okay, when I get into this room, I'll explain what's going on, but... Alright, chest strike first. The raids hit a lot harder than having more HP. Have, I think, 150 HP or, or such. So, yeah. Okay, the treasure chest, the one on top right, has a cloth in it, guarded by mages. I'm going to show this off one time. One time only. For a reason. And the top left is a flame sword, now as good as this ice sword. The one in the middle is guarded by an eye. And it has the floater inside, which is what we need to complete this uh, ice cave and to progress the game. Alright, let's go ahead. Okay, these guys, they don't hit hard, but they do have a chance to one-shot you. And if they one-shot the white mage, then I have no way of bringing them back. So, let's go for it. Okay, we got away. Okay, unfortunately, I have no way of bringing back the White Mage. Um, armor. I'm gonna drop the Iron Armor, and I'm gonna just show, show this off. Cloth. Yeah, we don't really need it. And I, I have enough money right now, I'm, I'll be okay. Let me show off the Flame Sword. Yeah, if you don't believe me, 4786. Forty-four eighty-one. Three less damage, five less hit. So yeah, not good. So let's drop down here. And let's I'm gonna use a fire tube just in case these this never mind.
Okay, we got out. Okay, so. I'm doing too bad. Red bones have like a 100 HP or 120. They hit, a, they hit ridiculously hard. Not ridiculously hard, but like hard, way harder than the bones. Regular bones. Prepare for 102 uh, frost uh, dragons. And they might go first. Yeah. Likely they didn't catch blizzard. Okay, good. The one in the left hand corner has a silver helmet. Which you don't need right now. And let's see here. 5854 is the same as the ice, but how much protects against fire? I'm not gonna chance it, so I already got one party member down, that's gonna suck. So yeah, that's gonna suck right there. No fire left. Okay, so we got two party members left. Let's see if we can get. I'm just gonna show off the uh, these treasure chests over here. Bunch of money. I'll come back for it later once uh once protected. The the one to right, yeah, this area. Chest right first. Yeah, he he are he tried to go again anyway. Yeah, heal up. Okay, I'm gonna uh, make sure everyone's topped off. It's just two characters, so I won't be using a lot of potions. Okay, so these guys can rub us. Okay, and rub. Okay, solo black mage it is. Heal potion. Okay, <laughs> 10,000 gold in the, the treasure chest down there. Tent. There's an ice shield in there, and line 500 gold in the left. <laughs> okay, everyone, wish me the best. Okay. <laughs> okay, I did not kill him. Fire three, go. <laughs> A glance stones you. So we got to the eye on our first go. But as as we progress, you know, we died. So this is the first party wipe I've had. Typical of the ice cave, but I was going to be surprised if I had defeated the eye on my first go. I've done it with the black mage before. The problem is I tried to rub him, and it, I think he's resistant to it. He's not undead. He's with the fire. So I, swear, I got bad luck on that fire three as well. Um, I got... Almost a bit of a, which is, uh, would have been like, uh, no, I don't think he's weak to it. I only did 56 damage, I think. Uh, and the minimum is 50, so, and he's not, he's not, uh, strung to ice either, so I could have used ice or whatever, but, you know, for a first attempt, that's not too bad. I mean, uh, I think I did better than average, you know, I normally do a lot worse than this. On average, but you know, to be honest, they got pretty lucky on this attempt to have gotten the eye my first go, even with just one character. You know, I got a little bit of bad luck with the mages and the uh, well, that was my fault going for the cloth. I just wanted to show these items off as uh, just to let y'all know what's in them, but yeah, um, I will have to try again, but I'm gonna go ahead and end it right here. I hope you all enjoy this. Uh, this includes part 6 of Final Fantasy 1. I uh, hope you all enjoyed this. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Justin, this is about to be 18. Peace out, everyone.